Yo, yo, what up, everybody? See, and I just wanted to do a, a, a real quick for the um the new patch, the patch uh twelve twelve. I just been doing it this first wipe. I've been enjoying this wipe extremely well, loving it. Um, I don't know a lot of other people they don't like it because of the movement. It's been changing. I love the movement. I think it gives um the um people like me that's uh not like you know real good. And in doing, you know, the AD jumping back and forth and shit, uh, just real quick movement on it. Um, and I like to play like tactical, so it just it just make, gives the playing field a real big advantage. But enough of that. I love this wipe so far. I just wanted to do my little um easy hide uh easy stash um stash run on interchange. I do it all the time. Um, I'm not going to go into the stashes, but I'm just going to show you where they're at and what kind of stash run I run. All right, so let's get into it. All right, we're going to start. You don't start here, but this is what I wanted to run over to this spot and start from here so you know, because that's this is the um, Axfil, uh extraction, and over there is a checkpoint where we're going to head. But anyway, we're going to go over to the, the first stash. Or last stash, you know what I mean? Most of the time, this is my last stash because most of the time I run from here and go to the X fill. Run from checkpoint to X fill. But in this case, we're going to go from X fill to checkpoint. So there's the first stash. And you keep on running and you make it to the second stash. Second stash is in this bush, as you can see right here. Make sure you squat down and get in that bush because you never know if somebody's coming your way. All right. So then you head straight across, go across these railroad tracks right here. And as you can see, you go up to your left, there's another stash box right there. Right? A lot of good stash, or a lot of good loot in these things, man. I'm not sure how, uh, oh yeah, and don't let that dinosaur scare you because it used to scare me all the time. But anyways, um, always good loot, man. Good. Loot worthy to sell. All right, you go to that tank, you bang, you see that angle I went on straight down to this first tree right here on your left. Boom, there's another stash. Hit that one, going on to the next. Going, going. Make sure you keep an eye up to your left where the blue wall is because that's where people are going to come out. I'll let you know as soon as we get there. But you come up to this stash right there, right where that blue wall is. Next stash. Look that way because you never know if they're running across there. But right there, right in front of me, always keep your eye right there because a the guy will come up around them walls and sneak up on you. These right here, they make noise. Let you know. Run on down. Um, there's going to be scavs here, man. If you're not a scav, if you're not running a scav and you're a PMC, there's going to be scavs here. Beware. And they do, they do not mess around. They will wreck you. There's another little stash right there in that suitcase. I've gotten uh, all kinds of good stuff in there, man. Usually, their scabs are right there on your left, right there. So just be careful. There's usually like two or three of them. Um, oh, right up, right here. There's always something inside this container, man. Right there, always. I always find something good right there. And then you want to keep on running. And this is, like I said, this is a really good run because, man, you're usually staying out of out of sight. You know what I mean? A lot of people don't see you. The only way you're going to run into somebody is they're running the same stash route. All right, you run down here to this white van right here in the back. There will be a suitcase. Most people know about these stashes, but I'm just letting you know the, the, the way I run it. You know what I mean? Sometimes you'll spawn right here. I'll run back, do those stashes. I... Thing is over there in checkpoint. I'll run and get those stashes and this run back this way. Backtrack. If I'm doing the stash runs, right? Go straight across right there. Another little stash box right here by this tree. All right. Run down. Run down into this ditch. You want to be in this ditch, man. It keeps you from people being able to see you. Um. You don't always want to run. I'm running through this to make it quick. Just be aware, man. People are out there. They hear you running and shit. I'm out of breath right here. I can't even jump. 
And that too, man. Always make sure you can jump those railings. You don't want to get to them and be out of fucking breath and have to sit there and wait so somebody can fucking shoot you. Make sure you have enough breath. You know what I mean? Stop running before you get to it so you build up. Or just save a little bit so you can jump. Right here is another suitcase and a little ammo box. Always get good ammo in there, man. All right, you're going to come up through here, come up on the back side of this other stash. Make sure you keep an eye out in front of you there because a lot of people would like to hang out around in there. Over, so just keep an eye out. You know what I mean? Hit this stash right here. There's another spot over here, but you need a key cord. I'll show you to you right now. You need a key card to get in that. If you have that key card, hit that. If power's on, all right. I don't have that. Key, I don't have that card, and I don't even know if power was on. So I just wanted to point that out because if I do have it, I hit that. Either way, run round. Usually, I run down along in that galley right there because it, again, it keeps you from people seeing you as easy. All right. There's the next stash right here. Then you want to run along this wall. Pretty much the rest. Uh, you pretty much run along this wall the rest of the way. And there's a couple more stashes along. So, I'll run down. And by this time, man, most of, uh, barely, rarely, I'm unless I have a uh, a big um ta uh, rig and a big backpack. Most of the time. I'm having to switch stuff out. That's how much stuff I get on on these runs. You know, I should have did the actual loot, but it's just, it'll just take a lot longer than me going through it and, and putting them in my stash. So I didn't want to take up too much time. I just want to show these these this run that I do. Um, there's a lot of good stuff in that thing. Sometimes, uh, sometimes I, I I'm real cautious about that spot because it's you know it's out in the open and that fire lights shit up. Right here, on your left. Make sure you look to your right before you hit this dash box and duck. You know what I mean? Because the motherfucker run up on you. You'll hear him. Just keep your eyes, your, your, your ears peeled. E ears peeled. Just beware. All right. I'm going to run along this wall. Keep along this wall. And again, when you're going from bush to bush, make sure you have enough energy right here to run from there to there. I don't want to be out in the open. All right. Right here. There's stuff around this campfire and in this bag. Just be careful because you're kind of in the open, you know. But it's all stuff all around here most of the time, right up around in, not that area, but this area most of the time. Now you're going to run straight across here to this little green box. Or a box covered with a green cloth. Boxes covered green cloth. To the left of it, depends what way you're coming at it. That's right there. Then you come over to the claw, a white cloth in a bush. Another one, right there. Like again, most of the time you have enough loot, man. You don't even need to do any more. Just run right to extraction, which is right in front of you. All right. But if you have enough. Or have that feeling that there might be something in these two little last stash boxes that you get, then go for it. Most of the time, I just run along that wall and go right out, all right? In this case, I'm just going to show you where two more things are at, all right? I really don't waste my time on this black box because usually it always has food, um, uh, um, one of them fast meal things in it, and like something else. Um, actually, I think I accidentally opened this. I always go in it backwards because you never know who's sitting over there, you know? But most of the time, there's always food in that thing. I think that's what I was going to show, but I was like, fuck it, why didn't I show the other ones? But anyway, you run from there over here to the last stash. Beware right here, guys, because you're out in the open once again, you know what I mean? Only if you want these, okay? A lot of people can see you. But anyways, you hit that stash box, box and pew! Right to checkpoint check or extraction oh yeah and be careful up there man motherfuckers be camping up in that little spot that i just showed you all up there and to your left they'll be camping waiting for you to come over here and try to extract but there you have it folks 
there's my um there's my that's that's what I do when I need money and um I mean you can literally just run in with nothing really. You just need a backpack and a rig so you can put stuff in there. But anyways, there you have it, man. Y'all be easy, stay classy, and um I look forward to seeing you or hearing you in the comments and on the next video. Be easy.